Hi, this is Rob Panzarella from Airline Hydraulics. Uh, I'm standing in front of our Citro box. We had supplied from Bosch Rexroth. This is a servo-driven hydraulic power unit. And we're just going to review some of the really interesting features that this thing's got. Uh, for starters, when we purchased it, first thing we did was put a, uh, a disconnect on this and a uh, quick connector for, for three-phase power. Uh, right now it's tagged out so we can go into the machine and just kind of review all of the different components. So the bottom portion is the hydraulic portion. So here's a quick layout of the unit itself with the part numbers and it's got a call out of each of the items. But this is the beast. This is a water-cooled servo motor. So the water, this is the cold water coming in. This is the uh, warm water leaving. So this servo motor powers a fixed displacement A10 pump. Now this is an A10 FZO, which means it's open circuit. It's getting its suction from the tank. And here is the outlet. The Z portion means it can be operated with, with a servo down to zero RPM. So it can stall and produce pressure. In addition to that, the pump is outfitted with a K-strain monitor. And that K-strain monitor will tell you the condition of this hydraulic pump. So if you see a high K-strain flow, then you can determine that perhaps maybe your pump is wearing out and needs to be replaced soon. So this will give you early warning. So you're gonna replace it when the pump is worn, not when it's catastrophic. So you can do this at a time of your choosing. In addition to that, we've got a, a gear pump here, which will cool and filter the oil. So here's our cooler. You can see the warm water line right here and the cool water line out of the bottom. And you say, well, where does this water come from? We've got a little chiller here from SMC. And I believe that the way this is set up, this will remove 10 kilowatts of heat but this thing is running so efficiently, this is only a 1500 watt uh, chiller. So there's some other neat things in here. There is a particle counter. So if for some reason you had a cylinder um, let go and it ingressed a whole bunch of debris, this would tell you that you have, um, you've got increased contaminants in your fluid. In addition to that, we've got a large uh, pressure filter a safety relief. And the neat thing about this is, oh, there is a pressure transducer up in here in the, in the manifold block. The interesting thing though is with the return. This return line that goes into the tank, this is a roto molded tank. And the interesting thing about this tank is it has a weir. So the fluid comes back in, it goes up, it goes down through this, and then it comes back up again. What that's doing is it de-aerates the fluid. So with a, um, this is a 20 gallon a minute system, but you can get this designed upwards to, um, I wanna say 60 gallons per minute, but you'd still only have a 150 liter tank. So this is the hydraulic portion of the machine. Now we'll look at the control portion of the machine. So the control portion of the machine has a Bosch Rexroth injured drive servo. So this powers the servo motor. We've got communications. So all of the data that you get from these sensors down here, that goes to the cloud via this device here. And it's just a power supply, line filter, and some other components. But for the most part, this is what provides flow and pressure to your system. And what's interesting is this is so accurate that this is more accurate than a standard mechanical pressure compensated pump because we're closing the loop around a pressure transducer. So it's holding better than a one PSI when it's sitting there um, stalling. One more important thing, because they're trying to keep noise down on this, so it's not only efficient, it's very quiet. This entire panel has sound deadening material and it has a, a concrete base. So this concrete base is dense enough that it absorbs any sound coming off the hydraulic pump. So this is a Bosch Rexroth Citro box in a nutshell. We're using this to test manifolds here at Airline. 
It keeps it quiet, it's efficient, and um, if you have any questions, please give us a call at Airline Hydraulics. We'd love to help.